All right, so we're in the future now, and a lot of things have happened since Villa Bag Day, including Christmas, in fact, Christmas Eve, the day after Christmas, the day before Christmas Eve. But here we are with our two bags of Villa Bag merchandise plus the three individual items that for some reason we paid a dollar for. We're at 43 bucks. Let's take a look at uh, what we threw in there during all that madness. So this right off the rip is probably about $30 uh, shipped. So we'll make a few dollars profit. I think these normally come out to about $7 in profit on eBay. Uh, we get those uh, pretty regularly there as they're sold on Amazon. I got this, looks like a shower drain of some sort for a fancy shower. Fancy shower. Yeah, definitely fancier than any shower. Uh, I'll ever have because I'm cheap and I'm probably die in a cheap grave and then um be buried in oh my goodness okay anyways uh this is low balmy this is some kind of fur walk assistant I have no clue what it is oh I bet it's for like you help dogs walk with it maybe or animals babies babies yep and then we got, this looks like another dog harness, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, oh no, no, this is suspender? What is shock doctor? Is that a Oh, it's like a shock strap. Shock strap. Okay. okay I'm Hopefully that wasn't used. Keeping the camera up here. We, we definitely wash our hands in this, uh, in this household. This is uh, some kind of wetsuit. Um, we sold one before. I can't remember how much we got. Probably got like 20 something bucks for it. Uh, got this uh, compression, compression support hosiery and I'm gonna try to stop talking now. CQR pants, these are a good $30 bill. We sold these a few times now, uh, even though they don't make a $30 bill. And then <laughs> we've got the uh, Bolt Tune. So I got a few of these when we were there, and they're like some real, they're like some really cheap headphones. Bluetooth headphones. Um, we have really good luck with the Bluetooth headphones we get there. However, these are kind of like the older style, where there's like a cord that wraps around your head or whatever. Uh, so we'll see how those go. Um, if not, they're good yard sale cannon fodder. Uh, some of this is going to go out to the yard sale. Uh, we're probably going to be forced to have one as early as late March, uh, which is kind of be before the beginning of yard sale season, honestly. I don't even know what this is. Shin guards, maybe? Sure. And then... Oh my god. You what are these? dump the whole bag. They're like candles, but... Oh. I they didn't... are candles. They're not light candles. So it's a big thing of candles. Big thing of candles. So probably about, I don't know, two, three hundred dollars. What? <laughs> How many move in over here? Oh. Alright. So, that's some kind of fake knitted scarf or whatever. Um, scarf. Got eyebrows remover for removing those. Pe oh, it's got a cord for oh. charging. Removing those pesky eyebrows. Yeah. Have you ever woke up one day and thought, man, if only I didn't have any eyebrows. Do I've got the product for you? <laughs> A salesman if I ever saw one. Then you got Rampow quality within reach. What's in there? Nobody I don't remember. Knows. I actually do, but I don't because my memory is shot. It's a USB-C cable. Wow. It's one of those flexy ones too. That, there, there, flex. <laughs> That's such demonstration. Such a package. All right. Um, another one of those headphones. Hopefully we can get, oh, it's a fancier one. Wireless stereo headphones. But it's the same thing. In a bigger box. Yay. It's the H2. Oh no, they're just, they're different brands. Okay. But it's the same thing in a bigger box. Got some kind of elbow sleeves or knee sleeves, one of the two. Got a mug and I did not know what's in here. 
So this is actually my bag, I think. Think. Nope. That, that's not YouTube, that's not family appropriate. So oh. we'll go ahead and just and, cover that up. Uh, there you go. Uh, <laughs> all right. O only the internet, the other parts of the internet can see that. Yeah, where we post the real content. Oh my goodness. We got the rain shoe cover here. I quit. Where's I lost there? Got the... <laughs> We got pet test. This is probably a good 10, 15 bucks, honestly, for something uh, like that. Pet lead. Yeah. Or lead. one of those things. Um, got some weightlifting gloves. These are pretty cheap. So, eh. Got a gun holster. I don't know where that came from. Um, this is something. I don't know. I'm just gonna destroy the package because it's already pretty. I think we got that because we didn't know what was in it and we were too... Oh, it was so packed as you probably saw um, in the footage in there that we didn't really want to stick around to. It's some kind of capacitor for uh, something from Kenmore and Whirlpool. It says microwave. Okay. So... Replacement parts. Yeah, some kind of replacement part. Sometimes those can be good. Um, got this blue page. It looks like a scarf. Probably. But it's really textured. It's really got a weird texture to it. For a clothing item. Got this giant plug because. Why not? Why, yeah, I mean, you know. Got this. Oh, USB C hub. I bet this guy right here is probably 15, 20 bucks. Those hubs tend to go pretty well for us when we get them. Uh, this is a keyboard folio thing for a tablet oh, yeah. with a case and everything. Uh, probably an iPad is my guess. Uh, probably 15 to 18 bucks. Got this carving fork here, pretty cheap. Probably yard sale item. This is actually ironically one of the bolo items. It's a Norelco shaving head. And I grabbed this, it's probably like 16 to 18 dollars. But it should sell almost instantly. Uh, free shipping, and it'll ship for nothing. It'll ship at the four ounce rate. Got this weird calm makeup moisturizing skin thing. Um, picked up this TV wear universal mounting system. I don't remember exactly what this one does. Uh, I have, we have sold that brand before. Um, and got this. So into the next, onto the next bag. I'll just go ahead and shovel this stuff over here because it's so valuable. Where it will stay forever. <laughs> Where it will be listed today. Safety grip tape. Um, probably 20 bucks here in safety grip tape. Um, it should be able to fit into a bubble envelope too for uh, priority mail. Uh, got this 10x magnification light up mirror. I bet this is $20. Mm -hmm. Probably. Got this magnifying glass that lights up. Probably a 15, $10, $15 bill. Uh, some kind of dog brace. Arthritis gloves, which I grabbed a few of. And this class squeegee. squeegee. Another crazy plug. Um, a stainless steel bottle. Yeah. Better than the uh, stainable steel bottles. Uh, take cool. A moisture meter. Moisture meter. So I'm not one of those people that like get concerned when people say the word moist. Do any of you guys think that's gross? Or gals? People say moist. I don't know why it matters. Moist. <laughs> this is, I think about 20 to $25. Um, it's something that we passed on on $5 day and definitely a good pickup on fill a bag. Got a wireless headset. We have some of these. I think they're listed around twenty dollars right now, and that's with sold comps to uh, compare them to. Uh, got this thing. It has a USB oh, thing. Lights. Lights. Sure. Um, trying to keep, get make this quick. Haha. Uh, but it's not gonna happen. This camera that's not that good. Um, Jeez. These gloves. Oven gloves. Oven gloves. Woo. I think. 
Yeah, they look really cheap. Um, this is dog harness. The dog harness. These go really well for us. And this is a big, huge dog one. We'll get 20 bucks easy for that. Uh, ship it a uh, $8 priority bubble mailer. Um, then I've got this guy, which I don't know what it is. And we'll figure that out. Sometimes you just grab some of the small stuff just to fill the bag. This wired wired controller, it's not wireless for PS4, probably only 20 bucks, but if we could put it in an $8 bubble envelope, uh, not too bad. Then we've got another Bluetooth headset here. These are probably better and probably around the $25 mark uh, for that. Uh, we got this circuit board thing. Some of this stuff is really surprising. This thing could be worth 20, oh, it's destroyed. It's worth nothing. I'm not messing with it. Next. It's got all that weird corrosion stuff going on there. I don't know what this is. It looks like pants are life -y. Um, We got it now. I don't want everybody in the comments to be like, well, what's that? Ooh, it feels really cheap. Leather? It's, it's a pleather jacket. Pleather vest. 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 Okay. That's done. Okay, what else are we looking at here? Got this air pump. Honestly, probably shouldn't have gotten it. Yard sale. This is going to be a lot of yard sale stuff. Probably not my... Not, yard sale is more to get rid of stuff. It's not really my business model. Uh, screen shelf here. Probably not worth selling on eBay. Um, we did grab... It's some kind of a DC adapter of some sort. We also have got this kind of brace thing. Um, this is something we got for a dollar. It's actually a band set. If it's all there, it'll be worth about 30 bucks. And we got this elect watch back case closer, which I guess is to close the back of a watch. Um, I have no clue what something like that would go for. So, haven't looked any of this stuff up yet. Haven't had time. We got Dobby P4 Pro Hub for a PS4 Pro gaming console, which will give you a lot of stuff on the front of your PS4. And it's never been opened. Don't know what that goes for. Hopefully a million dollars. So, uh, with that, guys, this is fill a bag day slash dollar day. And that's what we grabbed. A little bit of a mixed bag in there, but some of the items we should make, you know, under, I'm guessing, I'm gonna guess offhand, 100, 150 bucks in profit on the eBay side of things. The rest of the stuff will just blow out at our yard sale. Um, and that should be exciting for some people. Uh, I do appreciate everybody coming out and watching. Uh, some more serious kind of uh, picks coming up soon. Please like the, like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification, tell your friends, tell your family, even those coworkers that you don't like, tell them. And like subscribe? Uh, I said subscribe. Oh, sorry. Well, say it again. Like, subscribe, tell your friends. Oh, make a comment. Yeah, make a comment about what would you do? Would you buy two trash bags of stuff at the dollar day slash bill bag day? I mean, you do get to keep the trash bags, and they are hefty. With suffocation warnings on them. Mmm, fancy. Yeah, you keep it away from play pens. Alright, so with that being said, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.